Let's get started using Embroidery Toolshed Plus. I've opened up a design in my Embroidery Toolshed Plus, and I do have the ability to ungroup it so I can select individual elements. So I select the design that's on my workspace, click the ungroup option, and now I can select individual pieces by clicking and dragging a box around them. I'm gonna just use this house here as a separate element. So let's copy it and then open up a new workspace and paste it. Now I'm going to rotate it around using the circle on the corner that gives me my double rounded arrow. I can rotate my design. Now maybe we want to make it larger. So currently this design is a little over two inches wide and an inch and a half tall, so I can click and drag any of these shapes to resize or reshape my design. And I think that looks really nice. So now let's add some text around our design. So I'm going to choose my text tool, click on the workspace, and then enter my text in the properties box. This would make a nice housewarming gift for someone that has purchased their first home and then click apply. And I'm gonna put it on a circle path. Over here in the properties, I just choose circle from the type, click apply, and I'm gonna center that over my home. Now let's add text to the bottom. So click to add text to the workspace again. Let's type in our text. And here I can click to select different fonts. So I'll choose this one, click okay move that into position, double click my zoom tool to make it fit on my screen, and now I'm going to select just the house and group it together so that it stays together when I select all of my text and use my alignment tools. So let's center align and that looks great. Maybe move this down just a smidge. And now I'm going to change the color of this blue text. So the blue text is using color number one. So if I click on one, I can change to a different color chip. How cute is that? 